Hi, it's Adam here taking a look at some more software from Slate Digital. I have here what Slate are proudly calling the best automatic tuner on earth, which is a bold claim, so let's see if it can live up to that promise. This is Metatune from Slate. When you first load up the plugin, it shows you this really useful tutorial, so that's a good place for us to start. Um, first off, down here you can choose your scale from the preset options, or you can customize it using the keyboard. First off, you need to choose your scale that the notes will be tuned to using the preset options or just by clicking the notes on the keyboard. On the top right is the speed control in milliseconds. This is how fast the note is corrected. Slower for more natural or faster and even into the negatives for that share T-Pain effect. Sustain dynamically adjusts the speed setting when notes are held. The amount dial lets you control how much the tuning is being applied, so 100 for full and 0 for nothing and finding that sweet spot in between. The note stabiliser on the bottom is a great feature that prevents tuning notes during vibratos or when sliding between notes for a more natural feel. On the left hand side these numbers here are group settings, which allow you to link together multiple instances of Metatune and sync up their settings, perfect for multi-track vocals. More on that later. Let's jump into some examples. I have some lead and backing vocals here. I've got two tracks of lead vocals and four various different backing vocals. Let's just take a listen. S.E.P. You're somebody else's problem now, can't you see? You're stuck in a rut and you don't know how to let me be. I gotta let you... S.E.P. You're somebody else's problem now, can't you see? You're stuck in a rut and you don't know how to let me be. So let's just go ahead and apply Metatune to that first vocal only at the moment. I'll just turn the rest off for now. So here is the interface. -E You're somebody I'm going to first select my scale, um, A minor, um, which happens to be the same notes as C major. S E P. You're somebody else's problem now, can't you see? You're stuck in you a can run. see as it's playing the difference between the input and output heat maps here. Um, so the input is the pitches of the notes coming in, the output is the pitches after they've been processed by Metatune. Um, so you can see a nice visualization of what exactly is happening there. S.E.P. You're somebody else's problem now, can't you see? At the moment that's quite subtle, let's mess around with the speed and some of the other controls and push that up into some robotic territory. S.E.P. You're somebody else's problem now, can't you see? You're stuck in a rut and you don't know how to let me be. I gotta let you know, you and me might disagree, but I guarantee that now you're S.E.P. You're somebody else's problem now, can't you see? You're stuck in a rut and you don't know how to let me be. I gotta let you know, you and me might disagree. Pushing that speed into negative numbers really gets that robotic effect. It also comes with a load of presets, uh, including signature styles. Let's put uh, Believe on there and see how that sounds. S.E.P. You're somebody else's problem now, can't you see? You're stuck in a rut and you don't know how to let me be. I gotta let you know, you and me might disagree, but I guarantee that now you're S.E.P. A bit much for this instance, as we're not going for a kind of auto-tune obvious effect. Let's just turn that speed down. S.E.P. You're somebody else's problem now, can't you see? You're stuck in a rut and you don't know how to let me be. Trying to keep it natural. Um, what I'm going to do there is apply this to group one uh, just by clicking number one there. And then I will load up another instance of Metatune on that second vocal. Uh, just turn that on. Uh, and then if I click one there, it automatically loads in the settings that we've got. Um, so now you can hear both together, both tuned in exactly the same way. S.E.P. You're somebody else's problem now, or can't you see? You're stuck in a rut and you don't know how to... Now we're going to go on to the backing vocals, um, which are a lot more out of tune. I was singing quite far out of my range on some of these. S -E -P. Let's just stick with this first one for now, if we get rid of those. S -E -P. Can you see? So let's stick Metatune on here and we'll go for some different settings this time. Uh, again, setting it to A minor. S -E -P. Can you see? What I can do actually is um, I can turn off the rest of these notes because I know it's only a two note little phrase. S E P. It's just B and C. S E P. So I can ramp up the speed. You can hear it's a bit pitchy on that uh, second note. S E P. Can you see? 
what I'm looking to do is get it just below. It starts kind of sounding a bit robotic. Although because this is backing vocals, they'll be buried in the mix a bit. You can probably get away with a little bit more tuning than normal. S E P. Can you see? Let me be. Uh, so I'm going to turn the rest of these notes back on uh, because I'm going to apply these settings to the rest of the backing vocals which are sung at different pitches but still in that same scale. Um, so I'm going to sign this to group 2 and then I'm just going to click and drag Metatune onto all of these uh, just to sign them all to group 2. Couldn't be quicker. And then, uh, quick as that, we should have some nicely tuned backing vocals. If I tune them all, turn them all back on. S E B. Can you see? Let me be. And that's much smoother uh, and much more nicely pitched uh, than my initial rough vocals. Uh, let's add the uh, standard ones back in as well. S E B. You're somebody else's problem now. Can you see? You're stuck in a rut and you don't know how to let me be I gotta let you know You and me might disagree But I guarantee that now you're S-E-P S-E-P So what I've got there, just as quick as that, is some nicely tuned vocals uh, Not sounding too robotic uh, And just, yeah, ready to drop into the mix Another really great feature of Metatune is this XY pad here in the middle uh, And what this is, is a doubler So we've got dry wet along the top there and the width along the bottom. So if I just play back our single lead vocal. S E P, you're somebody else's problem now, can't you see? And then we can hear what that's doing to the right sound. And you don't know how to let me be. I gotta let you know, you and me might disagree, but I guarantee that now you're S E P. S E P, you're somebody else's problem now, can't you see? You're stuck in a rut and you don't know how to let me be. I gotta let you know, you and me might disagree, but I guarantee that now you're S E S E. And you get this nice visual representation there in the middle of the screen. Uh, and that's a really nice effect. It's pretty much an essential effect, I would say, on modern pop music. And it allows you to do it really quickly and easily without recording lots of takes and syncing them all up manually. So that is Metatune. Uh, it gets the results you want really quickly and it's really easy to use. Um, it's available now in the Slate Digital All Access Pass, which comes also with a huge amount of other plugins, including the Ana 2 synth and the new custom Opto Compressor, uh, along with loads of tutorials, samples, loads of stuff. Uh, head over to slatedigital.com to check that out.